Good morning. Uh, today I'm going to try a new product for me. It's been around on the market for a while. Um, I've seen some people using it and uh, many people say they swear by it now. They will not go back to traditional methods. I'm talking about one coat render opposed to standard sand cement render. So I'm going to try to use Weber or CR. Right, that's the one. This is going to be my first use of it, so I'm going to try. Apparently it's very sticky, very easy to apply. We'll see, we'll see. I've got a very small section of wall to, uh, to finish, and it's this section here, left hand side of the doorway. It's a bit busy there, you've got outside light and two fans and soil pipe coming out. And also here we've got sleeve for outside tap and washing machine thingy and outside socket. So, a few bits around, and um, it's been painted with some weird cold coating in past. As you can see, it goes all the way up. Um, that is, it's got sandy finish to it. It's very gritty and very hard, very hard coating. Um, so, to minimize any um, suction problems or whatever we might have issues with that pre-applied coating it's very solid it's not loose it's just coated with something we have applied uh, bonded exterior grit um, and basically bonded exterior grit it's, it feels and smells like a SBR with sand so I hope that's going to help um, with bonding our new render to this old wall. So let's start, let's start mixing. Also I cut a couple 4-6 inch lengths of uh, waste pipe, just put it on as a sleeves. So I can get nicer finish around the holes with the render. So once it's rendered and finished around it, I'll pull them out. So first thing, two bags. I'm going to put about nine, nine and a half liters of water.
Um, regards to application, it feels almost like if you're trying to spread tall adhesive, like render it with tall adhesive. Um, it's very sticky, definitely sticks on much better than and easier than sand cement. It keeps that stickiness and wetness throughout application. It's not drying or it's not separating water from the from the aggregate and um, I feel that yes it is one coat render but you have to sort of build the layers up you can't just go and do full 16 to 18 whatever 20 mil in one hit you spread you spread on a wall say maybe 10 mil half inch and as you spread the entire surface then just go back on it and top it up and once it's topped up we'll roll it off and then see what uh, the waiting times for finishing Right, it has been applied and ruled off. You can see it's fairly flat and the finish on ruling it's actually fairly smooth. Um, I've got a few little imperfections in ruling off around the cable and pipes. I had to finish with the back of the trowel there. It's just however you turn the straight edge it's uh, something is in the way so it's not one of the straightforward walls but it's small and um, I'm just gonna leave it now and see how long it's gonna take to sort of suck in a bit to dry so we can finish it now it's half past nine in the morning it's shaded side so it doesn't have sun on it see sun is a bit further down um, and it's 12 degrees Celsius feels a bit humid um, yeah so there are the conditions so it's in shade 12 degrees Celsius and um, yeah early in the morning well not early but morning Yeah. Well, we'll have to assess it when we're there, but the radiators are ridiculously heavy. They're car tied, a couple of them. It's half one now, and you can see it's still wet. We had a quick little rain, it does float up. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to leave it a bit longer. I might try the top just to see how it goes because always with cement then the bottom always takes longer because water drains from the back so I'll try to float the top
still a bit wet, but it can be floated. So I'll just get it out of the way. It's a bit more forgiving than a floating wet cement fender. Ooh, a bit of sunshine. A bit of sunshine. A bit of black clouds. God knows what we're gonna have. I just hope we're not gonna have a shower. That's gonna wash this off. You see the top? Quite uniform. My bottom is still a bit too wet. So top bit is been sponged, the middle section. I'm going to do now, and you can see now from that texture with a sponge, just a gentle nothing aggressive just uniforms everything up I mean, I still, still like sand cement, but the fact that you can finish this in one hit in a few hours, in half a day, pretty much. I mean, have a look. That's flat and uniformed in color and texture. I'm going to gently now try to complete the bottom bit and pray for rain to pass us over. <laughs> 